Hey folks, it's Carl here with the Barley Hopper. Thanks for joining us again. We're going to do another beer review. Uh, today I've got the Sad Panda Coffee Stout. This is from Horse and Dragon Brewing Company in Fort Collins, Colorado. And I got this uh, partly for my girlfriend because she loves pandas. Look at that adorable little frickin' panda on there. Isn't he a cutie? So let's see what this says. It's a uh, prominent vanilla and chocolate aromas are... Uh, balanced by wafts of uh, malt sweetness and caramel. The first sip introduces the complex combination of flavors you expect in your favorite coffee or stout. Bonus! That's what it says. Bonus! Exclamation point. Here you've got both. With vanilla and dark chocolate sweetness and a gentle coffee bitterness at the finish, this light body drinkable stout has a great depth of flavor that is smooth and satisfying. Share great craft beer. It says 6.8% alcohol. And uh, what else does it say on here? Uh, come visit us. I'm not going to do that. I don't live anywhere near there. This came out of the uh, the box that I did. I opened up a few weeks ago from Beer Drop. And uh, again, it's almost all Colorado beers. Stuff that I can't get here most of it. Or that I haven't seen anyway. So... That was really classy, wasn't it? Let's check this out. I'm trying not to dribble here. I feel like uh, I feel like I'm most of this beer. I'm just gonna have to wipe up. You have to sop it up with something. Maybe even my sweatshirt. I don't know. Let me get a little sopping rag going here. A good thing we can't go out nowadays, you know, with this uh, COVID thing going on. I just embarrass people. As I do, I try to pour stuff. It ends up everywhere. It's a mess. But anyways, check this out. It's uh, it's completely dark. Even holding it up to my lights, I can't see through it at all. You can't even see the light through it. And uh, again, what does it say? Uh, vanilla and chocolate and coffee. And that vanilla really comes through. It's a great smell. Mmm. Very rich. Very good. I would give this... I, before I say that, I'm going to have to take a couple more sips. I would give this... I'm giving this a 4.75. Um, and there's there's one beer. There are, there are a couple beers, actually, that I give a, a complete 5 to. And I did one recently. I can't remember what it is. But another one is uh, uh, the Omegang King in the North, which is, it's not the same style, but it's uh, it's just another fantastic beer that I will give a 5 to. And this is almost there. This is just a fantastic drink, but it's not quite, it's not quite a 5.0. I highly recommend this. And again, that's out of five. So this is a very, very um, good beer. So that is uh, more than halfway between Daddy Like and Beergasm. Beergasm being the top. Very close to a Beergasm, this one. And again, it's Sad Panda Coffee Stout. It's got the cute little critter there. Now, here's one of my favorite things about this beer. Watch, now I'm not going to be able to do it. It's got this uh, label. So it's got, it's the metal can. And it's got a plastic label. Oh, come on, you jerk. And you can peel off, when it's time to recycle the, the can, you just peel away the label. Which is easier on the first can I did this with. And uh, you've got, you throw away the label and you've got this can here. Very easy to recycle. Uh, so another plus for it. And again, it's by the, um, I already tore this up now. Horse and Dragon Brewing Company in Fort Collins, Colorado. Well, thanks again for joining us, folks. Again, I'm Carl. It's a Barley Hopper. Uh, please like the video if you did enjoy it. Uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, follow us on Untapped and Instagram. Our uh, tag is The Barley Hopper. On Facebook, it's The Barley Hopper, all three words. So 
We'll look forward to seeing you again soon. And until then, keep drinking beer. Cheers.